here on TV 18. Nick Catrumbos has joined us from Dino's and among other things. And um, so good restaurant life. And, and tell me other things. So um, Town Council, how long have you sure. been a part of it? Uh, it's going on two, two years now. Okay. I was, I think I may be the youngest person elected. <laughs> I'm, not, I'm not sure. I think I, I heard there was a good turnout to the polls, but um, it's, a, it's definitely a, a, a very gratifying yeah. job. Yeah. Um, it's a, interesting to be on the council. Okay. Um, we, we have quite a bit going on, yeah. um, which we can get into, but uh, there, there's... It was interesting when I got elected, I called my dad and I said, you know, hey, um, you know, I just got elected right. to the town council. And he said, well, con congratulations. Um, and then he told me about um, a story when, before the town was incorporated, um, he had bought Dino's okay. and then the, the town became incorporated. And the first thing he said is, you know, sales tax went from 3% to 7.8% or okay. whatever, and it <laughs> right? made the you know state news. <laughs> um, it was a, it was an issue, but he he told me that uh, the first he never got off to the on to the right foot with the town council because he you know one of the first restaurants own, own, owners to to want to bring in a satellite dish on top of the restaurant, <laughs> and it was against the ordinance, and there was no cable at that time, so. So he goes to the council and he says, hey, you know, I, I want to put this dish up. I want right. to play the Broncos games. Yeah. At that time, they had two channels and okay. you didn't okay. you barely get the games. Well, they denied him. <laughs> <laughs> so he did it anyways. <laughs> and he became the first sports bar, I want to say, in the county oh my to be able to play, you know, the football <laughs> games. And... Uh, <laughs> If you know Dino, yeah, very passionate about about football. That's was it was funny. It affiliated with you know uh, the University of Tampa and coaching okay. there before he okay. came to Winter Park. Okay. But you know, so it's interesting now to be on there. There's definitely challenges. You know, when, when you look at it from a business perspective yeah. and yeah. some things you want to get done. Right. But um, right now with with the council, there's there's great vision. Good. Um, you know, we're trying to provide or at least I'm there to try and provide the most conducive environment for small businesses <laughs> in a seasonal economy right, which is right. very challenging yeah but nice to have be able to wear yeah. both hats and what you can yes. benefit from both and, and it, it's good yeah it's good to have that yeah. perspective right absolutely right. one um, of our biggest changes has been transportation this year yep we um you know the the, the public spoke the um constituents spoke and yeah. said that they wanted transit. It was very top, it was a top yes. priority. I think yep. it's been discussed for over 20 years. Yeah. Now that we have a, a sustainable income source, um, it gives the town a lot of leeway. Uh, you'll start to see um, um, buses, you know, what the routes are going to look like during the off season. Perfect. Uncharted territory. Perfect. We've never done that before. Yeah. Yeah. Um, the the link, which is the late night shuttle, has been widely popular yes. with with everyone, whether yeah. you're a local or a tourist. So yep. to have that yep. opportunity to get home safely is incredible. I think they had picked up over 700 people on New Year's Eve, and maybe even more. Wow! And, right. And yep. it was, it was yep. fairly new at that time. Yeah. Um, we were the town received a eight hundred thousand okay. dollar grant from. Okay from CDOT, so we're able to yeah. purchase three brand new buses, yeah. and then we also purchased 10 um, new to us buses uh, this last month, right. which should right. be coming online in the next three weeks. Cool, getting new paint and wrapped and yep. fun new things. So uh, the, the leeway is very refreshing because when the town owns and operates the system, um, uh, the opportunity is endless. Yeah. Um, so we're going in the right direction. Cool. The second thing, that um, is very, very important that we've been pushing for yeah. is attainable and affordable housing. Yes. So we just hired a full-time person for that to, to keep an eye on that. We've hired awesome. many, many consultants and have done a lot of research. So we are, we're, we're behind in inventory for, right. for housing of right. that sort, but right. it's, it's a top priority and you're going to start to see some new stuff happen awesome. right That's away. That's awesome. Um, so it, it's exciting. Yeah. And uh, yeah. There's some development that's happening okay. in town where um, the, 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 the vision of the town has made and created an environment for um, to be as helpful as possible for 
some some land transitions that have happened and um, okay. some some bigger developments in town. Cool. So we'll start to see some of that. Yeah, shortly. we're booming. It's, it's happening. It's, it's happening while <laughs> preserving, you know, the lifestyle of what Winter Park right. is, which is so right. important. I know. I keep driving through town and think, okay, soon Winter Park and Fraser are just going to be connected and we're going to be big and it's going to be very interesting. It's it's, it's happening. Yeah. It's yeah. happening. So Cool. Um, Do you feel like you've been able to be part of that vision? Is that something since the two years since you've joined is a, like a big piece of that or other people as well have joined and you know it's it, when when I was elected there were uh, it was myself and another yeah. council member Chuck Banks who were new um, prior to that I, I believe the council members I don't know how many terms they had served but there's some people who've been there for a long yeah. time and yeah I one thing that I do need to point out that I didn't really realize until I was elected, mm -hmm. but those who were on the council were during the economic downturn yep. were able to preserve our budget. We never had to borrow money yeah. and and maintain all the services, yeah. like plowing the roads and taking care of the town, right. where right. a lot of other municipalities <laughs> struggled. So yeah. we got to commend them on, on that. But now you know we have a different economic climate. What's going on with Denver with I seventy? Yep. yep. Um, there are, are, we don't know yet but what the attributes are and why we're seeing mm -hmm. growth in town, mm -hmm. but it's, it's got to have something to right. do with that. Right, yeah. right. So we'll start cool. to see more. Well, good. And yep. Winter Park's getting a grocery store, and are they going to ever connect? Will Fraser and Winter Park ever be? Those are, that's a <laughs> county level issue, <laughs> which... Um, I have my opinions, but I'll leave them aside. <laughs> you, you know, I mean, there's a lot that can be done. Yeah. We do share a lot of services. Yeah. The police department, mm -hmm. the transit is mm -hmm. another example of mm -hmm. that. Um, uh, the, the water district. Um, so there, there's some interesting okay. Okay. conversations that need to happen yeah. in terms of, 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 of combining the municipalities. Yeah. Um, but in terms of growth, Depending on who you talk to, we've done quite a bit in town, and it might be going a little bit more towards the ski area. I think Got that's it. one cool. aspect yep. where yep. we can start to benefit going yes. into the future. Yep. Yeah. Cool. Yeah. Okay, well, we're going to take another quick break. Um, sure. We'll be back. We're going to learn a little bit more about what you can find if you head to Dino's um, today, this year, um, what's on the menu and some of their great wines and how Nick's played a role in that. So, um, again, big thanks to the Village of Winter Park for sponsoring this segment, uh, winterparkresort.com. You can check them out. Uh, Dino's is Winter, Dino's Winter Park. Dino's WP.com. Dino's WP.com. Um, and we'll be back. So, don't go anywhere. <laughs> <laughs> 